Hi everyone, Matey here. Um, should be just a short video. I'll show you how I create this image. We go from this to this with just a couple of extra textures. Um, we'll be covering you know, layer masks, um, color lookup, layer styles, and the camera raw filter. All right. I hope you enjoy. Um, if you do like these videos, please um, subscribe, like, and share. If you have any questions or if there's anything you want me to um, do in the future, let me know and I'll, I'll have a go at making it for you. So um, please enjoy the video. Okay, so I've got Doc and Kira here. All right, so this is, um, I took two shots of them so I could fix up Kira's hand there where it goes through his shoulder. So I've taken a shot with Eddie's shirt on. And I'm gonna use um, this Boker effect. And it's almost, it's a great background. So I'm gonna give him some fancy lighting with these two textures as well. So here we go. I'm gonna start off by bringing back Kira's hand there. I'm gonna do a, a layer mask. And with a black brush, I'm gonna paint that back in. White. This makes it a bit harder. So that's the hand fixed. I'll highlight both those layers um, to make a stamp. I can turn those two layers off now and I'll take the green screen off using the background eraser tool. I've got that tolerance set to 100 there so it should take out most of that green. Size these guys a little bit, I think. All right, control T to bring out the transform tools. So a little bit of green bleeding through on the hair in a few spots and there's probably some in here so I'll just fix that up by doing a clipping mask over the top changing that mask to hue and then I'll sample her hair colour and then paint over it and that should clear all that green away there Take a stamp of those layers too. So I've got it on one layer. I'll turn that off. Put my background in and behind them. <clears throat> All right. So now I'm going to um, going to copy that layer. I'm going to give it a lighting effect. Um, 
Control J to copy the layer. And if you double click, it brings up the layer styles. Um, I'm going to use the inner shadow, change it from uh, to color dodge, and I'm going to use some sort of goldy color, I think. Just to, you see around the edges there, make make the um, the light shine from behind them. All right, so I'll press OK. Let's put that up to 100%. Increase the distance a little bit and then the size. I'll just turn that down a little bit. OK, OK. So I'll bring these guys back using like that. There we go. So with this layer with the lighting effect, I'll put that over the top and change the fill to zero. So all it's going to do is leave that outline there, the highlighted outline. And if I put that underneath that couple there, I should be able to... Bring the highlights back to where I want them. So let's try that. So I'm going to just turn that effect down a little bit. Alright, so next thing we're going to do is I'm going to use these lights. Now, <laughs> I don't know how you pronounce this. Boca, Boke, Boke, I don't know, somebody tell me one day. How do you pronounce Boki? Is it Bucky? I don't know. I've got a noise in my head telling me Bucky, but I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to change that from normal to screen. 
and I am going to put a layer mask on that and with my couple I'm going to hold down my control key and left click on their thumbnail to make a selection and with a, a, a black brush with the opacity and the flow turned right down I'm going to start painting back I'm a couple saving some of the light especially around the edges to get rid of that selection now I could try turning the opacity down a little bit and just with Y in a few of these spots I'll just bring some of those lights back a little bit So I'm really happy with how that's turned out. It's soft and dreamy, and a couple look in love and about to kiss. So I don't think I need to do too much more to this. I'm going to I'm going to make a stamp, and I'm going to finish it. Actually, I might just try um, the color look up first. Um, let's go for candlelight cube. Change it to soft light sure that layer mask is highlighted I'm going to apply this image to that layer mask this is going to give it a little bit more color make a stamp camera raw Turn the clarity down a little bit. Okay, click OK. <clears throat> All right, there we have it. <clears throat> it's before, it's the after. Hope you've enjoyed the video. Thank you.